Hi. Polymorphism is one of the OOP concept. It means taking on many forms. Actually, in real life, a person can be many things at the same time. For example, a person also can be a student or an instructor, an employee or an employer, a husband or a wife and a mother or a father as well at a time. So we can say that we also experience polymorphic examples in the real world from this point of view. So based on the OOP concept, how can we gain many different forms? The answer is here. Please remember inheriting other classes methods and variables by the inheritance principle. And also we achieve an easy relationship between objects with that. For example, suppose that we have an animal class and a cat class that extends it. In this simple case, we can say that by being a cat and also an, an, an animal at the same time, the cat object has two forms. So we can say that polymorphism can be explained in a way that it is the capability of objects to act in many different forms and can be simply gained by inheritance. We have two types of polymorphism. These are dynamic and static. What about dynamic polymorphism? It is a kind of method overriding and one method with multiple implementations. And now what about static polymorphism? It is a kind of method overloading. So multiple methods with same name and also each method has one implementation only. Let's come to the benefits of polymorphism. These are, we can say that it is more reusable and saving time. Multiple data types can be stored by a single vari variable only, and it is easier to debug the codes. And now what about the rules in polymorphism? There are three rules. Firstly, reference type can be parent class or interface, but object type can be a child class. Second rule, secondly, reference type decides what is accessible and object type decides which implementation to be executed. And the, as the Third rule, I mean, final rule is that instance of keyword can be used to check if the object is certain class and returns boolean. Now I am going to talk about castings in polymorphism, which are upcasting and downcasting very shortly. Upcasting is a way of, uh, let's say, casting the smaller reference type, which is subtype, to larger reference type, which is su supertype. On the other hand, tab Downcasting can be defined as a way of casting the larger reference type, which is supertype, to smaller reference type, which is subtype. Thank you so much.